Hey guys, I'm Elzevain, and welcome back to another episode of The Coma Recut. Where we last left off was that we finally got the art portrait, or art portrait, that uh, we need to submit to kind of change our grade, I think. Uh, let me see if we... I don't think we can see the picture of our portrait anymore. We do have a media room key, which is what we're going to do today in this episode. Um, we did get a report card with our grades, mathematics, social studies, and art changed already. So it's now kind of like, at least not failing or like, not like pretending like we didn't turn it in anything. So pretty much that was pretty much where we are at. Um, if anything, we're going to try to get to the... Wait trying to think about it yeah we're supposed to go to the conference room but i need to make my way there because <clears throat> because of the fact that uh we need to uh move on with this game so far because there's nothing else i can do besides note hunting i guess i would call it um but we haven't gone to the conference room before and we haven't gone to the media room before uh there are a few lingering things in the library fourth floor but i don't think i'm gonna have to grab it because i don't think i can grab it because of the fact that miss song patrols hardcore patrols that area or hardcore patrols both libraries but also whenever you're in a particular floor she'll hunt you down quickly which is a bad thing for me as a player <clears throat> when i'm trying to get through these places and explore but i can't explore that well but let's get into it anyways uh, a little darker because of the fact that the, the clouds are it's cloudy today i know it's her i have a, i know it's her pretty much the the sounding of her is like there. Yeah, I don't think I need to loot anything here. Just need to be careful, that is. Okay, so now I can no longer save now at this point, it seems like. So I'm gonna have to be careful. But yeah, it's really, like, I'm sorry if I'm not speaking in this early part of the video, but, like, it's really harder. It's much more harder now because of the fact that there's so little room to run away from because of like if you look at the map it's like oh yeah sure we have a lot of places to go to but this level of the map is a lot more tighter and it's really hard to actually make any good things i know the lady's about to drop here there we go all right but yeah in general it's just harder for me to move to the places i need to get to quickly so that i don't die all right, here we go. I think we're gonna we're gonna try to get to it. I think we need to go to the men's restroom. I think, or the females' restroom. Men's restroom, yeah. All right, cool. So we can go through here. We can't save still because it's literally a place where there's nothing I can do here. Literally nothing I can do here. Um, if I recalled. We haven't been to the ladies' restroom, I think, but I don't know if there's anything blocking it in any in any sort of way. So we're gonna have to be very cautious here. Um, I see a poison plant there. I see. Maybe it might be. Yeah, it might be that thing on the floor. Every now and then I see that thing and I'm just like, uh, <laughs> enemy. Okay, let's see what what we can have in here. Lock tight. Okay, at least that's a hideable area now to know. Eerie, looking like we're floating in the area. Yada yada yada. Oh. Okay, nothing useful, sadly. Yeah, we don't have much on our. We don't have any. I can only take about one hit. And then I need to throw up the, uh... <sighs> yeah, because I walked backwards. Now it's like a little bit harder for me because I can't really run anywhere. This is like a clear dead end. <laughs> it's like a, an absolute dead end here so far. All right, let's, yeah, let's get through this at least. Okay, screw. Oh, I see there is a lady there. I don't know what the difference in sounds Miss Song makes compared to the people that are on the floor. Because I did see the little lady on the floor. I just don't know what to do with the lady on the floor yet. I need to get close enough where I don't get whacked. But it will potentially whack me anyway somehow if I'm not careful. I 
I can't see anything. It was really difficult. Could not see anything. Really difficult to see. Bottle of water I don't care for as much. I'm slowly trying to scope out this conference room so I can grab whatever I can. Hey, there's a save point. Nice. There's a bunch of paper cups in the cabinet. That's it, really? That's all you get to tell me? Jesus. Alright, brand new day. Brand new save. So we're saving on the top right side of things. Alright, we're almost close to the media room. We just need to unlock it. Let's go. Oh, there's a poison plant right there. So the whacking is literally just the, uh... Oh man, I can't even save in here. Need to be cautious. Huh? Oh god! Thank you for saying exactly what I was gonna say! <laughs> that took a few years off my life. I don't know if that's true that they would do that, but... Sure. Stop this evil. Seahill isn't the friend I once knew. Something evil is gripping him. Gripping him. I need to act now that I've learned his true intentions. I may be the only one who can stop him before it's too late. Nobody would believe me anyway, so... What choice do I have? Taehoon Jung. I'm slowly starting to think about it a little bit more. But I think that Siho is about to attack Mina, and the reason why the bully Taehoon Jung is actually trying to latch himself very closely to Mina is because he wants to protect Mina from Siho. And I think that's probably what it is that's um, forcing that sort of like relationship to be very close to each other. But it's kind of weird though, honestly. How old is this thing? The tape's gonna. Is the tape's only gonna work with those one of those old camcorders? Someone scribbled a title on this DV tape, the secret, or the secret. I guess whoever made an a, a, made it actually wants someone to watch it, or maybe not. The format is the format isn't e exactly readily available. I'm sure this belongs to Taehoon. I'm dying to see what's recorded on it. Nothing here is gonna play this tape. I have to visit a specialty store or something no way i'm gonna find that device in a place like this i had a feeling <laughs> i had a feeling it would be in one of these areas <laughs> if it says it's not playable here it's like oh fudge you're gonna force me all the way back to some place i need to go back to that kind of sucks though it's like i had to force myself all the way back so that means i have to make a run for it isn't it Oh my goodness, this, this is so bad. Oh, I hear her footsteps. Yeah, I, I hear footsteps. It's walking to the right, so I'm, I'm actually blocked off for now. I'm going to wait till that footstep walks to the left in order to do whatever. Yeah, I'm hearing the footstep coming back. I think we're fine for now. Alright, I don't know if there's any new notes here, but I do want to save. At the very least, because... Just in case if Miss Song attacks me and I die, like, literally right there, I would be so freaking pissed. Oh yeah, bottle of water. I would be so pissed at myself. Alright. Funny because I smoothly walked through that. I walked through that without thinking about the enemy that was sleeping on the floor. Because I know there was an enemy on the floor anyways, but... Alright. We need to head out of here anyways. Somehow. Um, so we're here. The restroom we exit will be at the... Media art room floor, I think. So we need to get to the toilet next door to the area here. Which is... We're in the men's restroom, I think, or the women's restroom. I can't remember which exactly. It's funny because the men's restroom, you can't tell. 
I don't think I hear anything, but I'm gonna risk it. Oh yeah, I hear my song in here. Right, good. Made it through here. We can kind of walk here like normal. Is there anything over here that I'm just missing out on? Oh yeah, the dice game bowl crap I've already seen. Okay. Yeah, we're fine here for now. I don't think there's anything too traumatic or problematic here. So we're all good and fine here in this room. Waiting for that body to drop. Let the body hit the floor. Let the bot. I'm sorry, the song just started pop popping in my head thinking about that. <laughs> Alright, I don't need to be in here yet. No, 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 I didn't mean to go back in. Okay, there we go. Okay. Um, where are we at here? I don't. I think that when we exit this, we should be in the library fourth floor again, I think. I believe that was where we come out of here in terms of it. Is the restroom in the library fourth floor, I believe. Yeah, it's really tough to just, like, walk through the area and just, like, get out of here. But it's, like, one single line. And I think that's the hard part. That's the hard part of this game. It's just, like, why are you making it such a single, a linear line of walking when you should give the player, give the player a chance to escape via, like, options. Like, provide other openings and stuff like that. I don't think I hear any clickety clacks or scratching of wood yet, so we'll have to see. Okay. Let's check this room for any new objects, if there is any. But it doesn't look like there's any objects in here, so that's good. Alright. Yeah, we are still in fourth floor library. We need to get to third floor library in order to get out of this mess uh, to the main building again. I mean, I'm, I would probably prefer the main building because the main building is much more open, I think, is the better word. It's a lot more open and that your escape routes are like at least two instead of one. In this case, we're in the north building and that's this north building is only escape room of one and they force you to hide. Like, a lot of the times, it's just strategy of hiding. Oh, jeez! How the hell did she see me like that? What the fudge? That makes zero sense! Okay, I need to run backwards, I think. I need to actually heal, actually. <laughs> uh, screw it. I'm gonna spend that burger there. Oh wait, she actually lost me? Yeah, she's walking to the left. The hard part is that it doesn't seem like she can be... Yeah, I don't think she can enter here because she didn't see me walk in here. She's just... She's just hard assumes that I actually ran off. Yeah, she's walking to the right, from the right. Okay, cool. I mean, at least we healed a little bit there, but that's... <sighs> like, now I can't really, like, heal any further, so it's gonna be problematic here. Oh. Yeah, the whacking sound is probably one of those bodies that, like, hides under the table and such. useful I'm risking it because I need to get the notes if there's any nothing useful okay time to hit the downstairs oh geez that scared me oh no not again ah oh, dude 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 seriously okay in here Oh, son of a gun. I don't have any freaking oh, antidotes right now. Oh, that's so jank as hell. I'm going to have to head back to the cafeteria in general anyways. 
I think that's where I'm gonna hit up right now. Yeah, so I'm gonna probably go back to the main building so I can explore whatever I have missed out on. Yeah, she's out there. Miss Song is like actually sitting outside of the library third floor so far. I can't do anything and I can't heal myself. I do have money to heal myself. It's just I can't heal myself at the current state right now because of how... I'm also double checking this floor or this room area because I want to make sure I didn't miss any potential notes. More Death Espresso coffee. I hate it. Stop giving me stamina based food. It's useless to me. <laughs> well, I mean, if I'm running away from Miss Song, it would make sense that it's useful, but... In the scenario that, like, you know, where I'm not really needing it, it makes zero sense for me to keep it. I mean, I can throw it away, but it's like... Might as well just keep it and just hold on to it for a little bit for the time being. Because of how... Uh, because of how much I don't have anything to do with it. The antidote's very much needed right now. But I need to also get a burger because I need to... Get the fudge out of here with health. At least decent health. Alright, we are literally a bit of uh, ways... Yes. Um, there's no antidote, so I'm gonna have to risk it. Gotta go in here. I believe this the breathing is, uh, literally this, yeah, monster on the table. Literally, that's usually what happens. I think when you shine the light on the bodies, on the, the things under the table, I think, or under the bottom floor parts, I think they get distracted, so they just swipe, thinking that you... Uh, walked by there or something like that. I feel like that's what it is, but I'm not entirely certain. Man, I'm about to lose another health bar right here. Screw it! Running for it! Oh no! I'm about to die! Oh my god, that sucks. I need to literally grab a burger right now. I need to eat it now. Oh, thank goodness. That was a barely freaking okay matter of points. We, we've lost like literally a whole health. Uh, I hate this so much. I need to get back to the cafeteria just for the, uh, the saves, but I'll save here, I guess. I hate this so much. All right, at least we get to explore the main building once more again. I know there are some places we haven't revisited in a while, so we probably might want to revisit them since we got the chance to here. Any new objects to grab a hold of? I also think that the main building has the most room for like exploration stuff, but I may be wrong. If I get chased, I don't care anymore by this point because I'm very close to the, the cafeteria anyway, so... Okay, is there anything here? Something's not right. Oh, okay, that's... We're better than you, what a motto. Okay, so that's not much either. I was just listening in to see if there's any... <clears throat> to hear if she's anywhere in the placement in front of me. Then again, I don't know. The poison's about to go out, but at the same time, I, it will probably take out a heart from, from me. Bye, lady! No, thank you. Oh, thank goodness. I finally got in here. 500. Hey, convenient. <laughs> Uh, I need to buy a burger as quickly as I can, but... Alright, let me buy that burger. That's all my money. Literally all my money gone. I hate this so much. I don't want distress with coffee. It's annoyingly bad. Alright, is there anything new note-wise or books or something like that I need to worry about here? Same eyeball placement, so that means nothing really changed, pretty much. Thank goodness we got through that. 
Oh my goodness, I really didn't like the fact that I had to deal with Miss Song every single time when I want to come by here. Like, every single time. I really dislike Miss Song. It's worse than most of the AIs or monsters or enemies that I've faced in many other horror games. It's just like, it's not any uniqueness into it, it's just annoyance, rather. I don't know, it's just really annoying. I, I don't like to complain, but it's just making me frustrated because every episode is like the same situation of where I can't figure out any better ways of avoiding these situations, but whatever. So Headmaster's Office is... The best way to get to it is through 3B. So we would have taken the stairs down and then run through the staff hall because there's only one way to get to the office. And that's through uh, the staircase, the middle and far left staircase, I think, through uh, through the um, through the third floor. Uh, okay. Um, and then, of course, if we want to take it the other way, we can also go through... Um... Actually, I don't remember if the me medical center was blocked off or anything. I don't think it was. So we can probably take this the downside. So there's like literally two ways to get in there. Two, three ways to get into the second floor and all the way down to the headmaster's office. But that's like more riskier because of how Miss Song could just randomly be at places I don't want her to be. But giving it a shot. I think there's a high chance she won't show up too early sometimes, and then she does. I'm a little confused. I think the last time when we be when we were here, the lady from the ventilation didn't show up before. So I'm guessing that she probably shows up or spawns up now because of the fact that we are progressing through the game. I think some places end up being more dangerous later on. Yeah, I'm going through the staff lounge and then the council office and everything because I want to double check the areas to see if there's any new added notes into those rooms. Uh, though I do think that we'll probably get to the places we need to get to when we can. If she is out here, I'll probably book it to the cafeteria as fast as I can because the cafeteria is still 100% the safest for me. Yeah. Honestly, this lady is reminiscent to... Uh, this lady looked different, I think, from the older version, I think. I'm not sure if it's the older version or a different version of the game. But her basically, her body wasn't like that. Her body was like her head was in the toilet, basically, is what I saw the last time when I watched the video guides of this game. But I think the developers updated it where she's just sitting there with fetal position rather than... Rather than force of forcing her head into the toilet there, because it's such a sad thing to see that the, the lady would have been in the toilet. I hear slight breathings from the outside, but I'm not entirely sure. Not outside the room, this room, but like outside this this little restroom. <laughs> I think we're okay. Oh, come on. Back to the cafeteria I go. Nope. Freaking dumb as hell. Dumb. I really hate it. And then not only that, she can afflict status effect too at the same time. That's what, well, that, that's something I really dislike. It's not the idea that it's made it getting it more challenging. It's just the idea that it's making me more annoyed with finding ways to manage myself and not die, or at least let myself like not die die all right i still need to find a i need to literally book it here so at least the game is slightly forgiving where it allows me to move forward a little bit before actually spawning Miss song up i think i think that's what it is i might be wrong Alright, let's double check this area. Water, whatever. Yeah, I'm trying to see if there's any new notes of sorts or pick upables. Because sometimes they will do, throw that at me and I wouldn't know. 
actually, let me let me devise a plan. So every time I go into a room, I need to devise a plan so I can get to the thing faster, somehow. Um, and that case is that we need to. There's no hiding room in the staff lounge, so we need to figure out or establish like ways of path to hide and wait for her to pass by. Maybe through the counseling office and back up to 3B, I guess. Yeah, maybe we might need to go through the, the, the two office and stuff, but... Let's do it. Screw you, Miss Song. I hate you. If your name is Miss Song, I'm sorry. <laughs> if you're an actual teacher named Miss Song, I am deeply sorry. Okay, so there's nothing good. There, there's a hiding spot here. Good. Yeah, I sometimes forget the layout of the land because of the fact that uh, things do change, so I don't usually remember. Or, not things have changed, but like, there's such a big space and I'm playing a bunch of other games. Oh, I hear it clap. I mean, I, I heard her clap, meaning I heard her tapping foot. Her footsteps, basically. I don't think she's on the floor anymore? Doesn't tell you usually if you're on the floor with her anymore or not. She doesn't tell you at all. Like, there's no messaging or there's no way to know if she went up the floor or not. Sometimes you, you can tell, I think, maybe, but I don't think there's a guaranteed chance of me knowing it for certain bottle of water I don't really need actually no I want to drink the water bottle of water because I don't really need it it's so pointless bandage I will keep that for now I think that's still that's still not the best but it's still at least something that works for me which one was the one that can hide okay the closest one basically we're almost there we're almost there Just one stupid room ahead. Here we are. My goodness. What a stressful way to get to the freaking room here. Not only that, I don't even remember if... I don't think there's a save spot near here either ways. That's the weird part for me. Alright. Oh, is that the thing that can play the tape? I'm guessing. Okay, yeah, the note taker's over there. Okay, so it's still that same error message, the blue screen of death me message every time. As usual. I'm pretty sure there's nothing new here, but I will probably double check this area anyways, just in case. I'm always liking to be a little bit prepared with my things and not like be bothered by missing stuff. Random stuff. Red on the wall. I don't know how I'm going to get the message here. I believe there was a thing that people did in a past session. Or in the guides, I mean. But I think things got moved and updates caused the, some of the stuff to probably be behind certain actions that I haven't done yet. Or some certain objects I haven't picked up yet. And I'm assuming I'm probably going to get the bad ending, though. That's my best bet for myself, personally. Alright, let's do this, screw it. Oh crap, I almost forgot about the tape. Maybe I can play it here. Hey, that's the library in the North Building. Oh... Why is she so creepy? Oh my god! That's the shade that took Seal. What the? What's she doing? Whoa! It's some kind of secret room. Tehun must have found out about this <clears throat> and started looking into it himself. That's why he was going to the North Building to investigate. It all makes sense now. That must be how. That must have been when Myungil's ghost took him out. Took him out. Oh, Myung Gil is the bully. Sorry, Tehun is the guy who committed suicide in the in the world. I keep forgetting that. Is that Miss Song? What's she doing there? Okay, it's settled. I'm gonna finish what Tehun started. The shades seem to open up some kind of room using that bookshelf. I need to keep my eyes peeled. Oh dear, Jesus! 
The video ends here. Alright, it's go time. Wait, don't tell me you're kicking me out of... Okay, I thought they were kicking me out of this room. So it's go time, meaning that... I don't know why they loaded it up like that, though. Because usually they just end the message with, like, a... Uh, with a thing, I guess. Like they end the message with, like... Uh, it, it's, it cuts back to this particular room and stuff. But nothing more than that, usually. Right, let me double check this, because it looked like it loaded some stuff, so I'm guessing there might be more things added to this space. If not, then whatever. But anyways, I need to probably find a quick room. Find a, a quick passage to a save spot. Uh, a saving spot so I can save and then move forward to uh, the next episode, that is. Because I'm already technically out of time. Sadly enough. <clears throat> okay, so there's nothing there. Just more messages about things in this room, the computer room. I'm wondering if the study room C would be available for usage later on still. I still haven't really figured it out yet. Okay, so I can't get into the... I need to get into the staff room, but I, at the same time, I don't think that's... Yeah, I need to hear if she's out there. At the same time, I need to devise my next plan or what I'm going to be doing next. I need to avoid getting hit as much as possible. So I'm going to get into the cafeteria, I think, to kind of make my way there. So I can be safe and save there at the same time. Save my progress there. And then we'll probably see how we're going to do for the next episode. Because the next episode is where we're going to be probably using our chances to get to places we need to get to. Also, we still need to visit some of the other rooms again. Like revisit 3C, 3D, and 3E in some capacity. Um... And also there's some rooms that are inaccessible to me, uh, which is counseling office is one of them, which I still haven't, I, which I didn't notice that I forgot that I didn't get into there before. So maybe there might be a thing we need to do to kind of get to it. Um, yeah, so my best bet is to go through the staff room if anything, if anything, yeah. Alright, cool. That's that's that. I can't do anything about it. Gotta check the room for more materials to grab a hold of if I can. Sucks that this is not a saving room at all for me. Is there anything over here? I don't think there's anything else here, yeah. Okay, so my best bet is that if she is around here... Maybe to the if she's on the right, that would be great. If she's on the left, I'm screwed. So I'd rather just like take my way up to the top stairs, I guess somehow. Yeah, we'll have to see. I don't I don't think we'll make it out easily, but we'll see. I'm hearing a heartbeat, but I'm not sure if that's. Music or just a signal that says that she's there. The only easy sign to tell is that her clickety clacking of her shoes are on the outside moving around, or if it's just like growling, but that's the hard part to really judge. That's her. Fudge! Up. Oh. oh dear. I forgot this is the only way in, out, and <laughs> I forgot that was the reason why 3C is not easy to get to. 3C, 3E, and 3F. 3E and F uh, are really difficult. Oh, that's the chocolate. Actually, I think chocolate heals me. Let me get rid of that. I don't really need it. Bam, done. Got it. 
Yeah, it heals me by one. Damn it. Whatever. I guess it'll, it, it's easier that way, I guess. But it doesn't save me more. It doesn't save my spot or my position as, as much as it would be. Um, if anything, I can only take the stairs up or down now at this point. But at the same time, I want to revisit D and F. But I'm going to have to figure out a way to get to a room that saves. I need to save progress, not lead myself into new content rooms if there is like another content room okay well let's look 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 do, 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 do. Oh, i'm sorry i'm making noises because i gotta keep myself calm but i'm like i am super not calm i was not super calm at all for that situation there Ah, uh, son of a gun. It's not an area I can save. My only choice is 3E now at this point. I don't think she's on this floor, though, judging from how quiet it is from within the room. It's also interesting that there's a lot of... Uh, A lot of closets around here. Okay, cool. We can actually save here. Alright, cool. Thank you guys for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next episode of Nobody Minds. Hope you guys have a great amazing <gasps> day. Good night. Or whenever we're watching this. Jesus. We're gonna have to freaking go all the way back to the North Building again. Uh, but there's no easy way to it at this point. I don't think. Actually. Is it a dead end? I don't remember if 3E was a dead end room at all. All right, I'm going to risk it just to see if there was a dead end room here. I'll let her kill me. I don't really care anymore. It's locked tight. Oh, it is not. Okay, cool. All right. Lull the sound. Yeah, I'll, I'll let myself die there. That, there's a reason why I left myself to die there. Because I was, I was not actually planning on continuing forward. But I was just double checking to see if the... If that staircase was open for me to just kind of go through um, so I can get to the north building again and just continue the game. Otherwise, that's pretty much it for me in this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next episode Nobody Minds. Hope you guys have a great, amazing day. We're going to one of watching this. Hopefully, in the next episode, we will make more progress. And hopefully, if anything, we see the end of the game. Um, maybe a good ending, hopefully, if we can get to it. But I don't know if we're going to be done with the game in the next episode or two. But hopefully it is, but I, only, I, can, I can only have hopes. I can't really do much beyond playing it further and seeing how far we can get it to, but otherwise that's pretty much it for me in this episode. So yeah, otherwise that's it for me. Like there's no, nothing else to talk about, so yeah. Anyways, so that's it for me in this episode, and so Roz, out. <laughs>